quotes Rahul in UN petition on Kashmir. Kong calls it mischievous. Congress spokesperson Randeep Surjewala has said the party has come across reports of petition moved by Pakistani government in UN on Kashmir issue, wherein Rahul Gandhi's name has been mischievously dragged to justify its lies. Jammu, Kashmir and Ladakh shall always remain an integral part of India, he asserted. Pakistan quoted Rahul as saying that people were dying in J&K. A government using brute force to stifle voices of dissent in Kashmir. Mamatourist Bengal Chief Minister Mamota Banerjee on Wednesday accused the PM Narendra Modi-led central government of using brute force to stifle the voices of dissent in the Kashmir Valley. She also accused the government of appointing, yes men, at the top of important institutions. All the institutions are headed by retired persons, who have no accountability, added Banerjee. People will thrash Kong with shoes for backing Article 370. JNK Govi Jammu and Kashmir Governor Satyapal Malik on Wednesday said that people will thrash the Congress party with shoes during elections in the country for supporting Article 370 in the state. Malik also said that former Congress President Rahul Gandhi behaved like a political juvenile Jew, to which Pakistan carried his statements in its letter to the United Nations. Kashmir India's internal issue Rahul after Pak quotes him in UN plea Congress leader Rahul Gandhi has tweeted, I disagree with this government on many issues. But, let me make this absolutely clear Kashmir is India's internal issue and there's no room for Pakistan or any other foreign country to interfere in it. This comes after Pakistan, in its letter to UN, quoted Rahul as saying that people were dying in J&K. Jairam responsible for UPAII's policy paralysis. Congress Moyli after Congress leader Jairam Ramesh said demonizing PM Narendra Modi all the time isn't going to help. His party colleague M. Virapa Moyli claimed Ramesh was responsible for policy paralysis in the UPA2 government. Moyley called for appropriate disciplinary action against Ramesh and Congress Shashi Thawar, who'd said that PM Modi should be praised when he does the right thing. The 